Hey guys, Kim here and welcome to my channel. Today's video is inspired by Not Geo at National Geographic and I'm going to be drawing this monarch butterflies. Follow them if you haven't already. Just not sponsored whatsoever. I'm just like, I just love these colors. I love butterflies. I just love this. It's so cute. Really good picture of it. So let's get started. I have my marker paper here, my DIY journal. I'll be using markers like from Lindsay Newton. Um, I think this is the Crayola ones. And also I have um, the Zig memory system calligraphy pen. Um, so yeah, let's do that, shall we? <laughs> this is like my failed Chicago. <laughs> um, failed Chicago really quick impromptu doodle. Yeah. So I'm just basically gonna ring it. I haven't drawn or used my markers in a while, so this should be fun. And as you can see, there is no like pencil marks whatsoever because I'm just, like I said, just winging it, doing the basic outlines of it all and then just gonna fill in the gaps later i'm starting with the leaves because i feel like that's kind of like the easiest part and i feel like i really want to see this in real life like i feel like it would be so magical to actually see a tree full of monarch butterflies and it's just so sad that they're like slowly dying you know so, I need to change our ways for them to live longer. Okay, so I'm done with the green. Now I gotta find where it is. Oh, hold up. Alright, and now I'm using my Windsor and Newton pen. I feel like this is so juicy. are for the butterfly wings. And I'm just making some random shapes in here. They look like bananas, Loki. Someone answer the phone! Someone answer the phone! So as you can see, I'm just making like long lines and a bunch of circles here. Alrighty, now it's time for the black part. Doesn't really have to be perfect, and I'm using the Zig calligraphy pen. And then just make the tiny dots over there. Close enough, right? Close enough. And just basically do it with the rest of the things. And lo and behold, it will look like a monarch butterfly spread in no time.
Alright, so here's the inspiration. Here is the final product, I know. Well, close enough, right? Close enough. I really like like how I just like just went for it, just color color and just like like doodle all over it. So it's kinda like a interpretation of this one. But yeah, I really like how it came out and I know it's like very, very like Oh my god, what is it? But that's the beauty of art. It can be beautiful to you and horrible for other people. But hey, you do you. You do you. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to see more of this weird doodles of mine. Alright, see you in the next one. Goodbye!